Hello everyone, Drum Tech Drummer and YouTube Educator Kenny Scher is coming to you with a product review and demonstration video for a trio of brand new bass drum beaters from Dragonfly Percussion. Now Dragonfly Percussion has combined unique materials with some unique designs to create an elegant and expressive set of bass drum beaters designed to give you warm tones without sacrificing articulation or playability. Now I as a drum tech know for a fact that one bass drum beater does not serve all kinds of music. When it comes to drum and bass, Americana, folk, acoustic shows, country, modern country, and jazz, these styles of music tend to warrant warmer bass drum tones, be it live or in the studio. And we as drummers tend to reach for like hard felt beaters or soft landswell beaters to get those tones. However, I know that a hard felt beater can sometimes be just as aggressive as a plastic beater. And that if you're not used to it, playing articulate bass drum patterns on a soft landswell beater can be quite challenging. I gave these beaters a check out, played them, put them through their paces, and I gotta say honestly, as a tech and a drummer, Dragonfly Percussion has nailed it on the head for giving drummers a set of great sounding bass drum beaters that give you warm tones that are still articulate, very playable, and basically give you everything you love about hard felt beaters and soft landswell beaters and none of the things you don't like about those beaters. So with that in mind, let's check out these Dragonfly bass drum beaters. Now first up is the soft flannel beater. It is 50 sheets of flannel compressed on this brass peg to create a beautiful warm soft beater that is designed to give you articulation even at the softest most legato of bass drum patterns. And I gotta be honest, it does y'all. This is actually the beater I've been looking for all of my life, man. Been waiting for this beater. I put it in, I was able to play soft warm patterns and be articulate, didn't feel hesitant. Uh, the playability was phenomenal and the tone was beautiful y'all. So let's check it out. All right, up next, y'all, was the medium canvas beater, which is 40 layers of canvas compressed on the same kind of brass style peg and just firmly put together. And this was actually the surprising beater of the group. I was surprised at the tones I got. It's like a hybrid between a lamb's wool and a felt beater, warm and soft, but still a little bit more punchy and present. Much like the soft beater, articulation was no problem. Much like the soft beater, there was still some presence and punch, but this one was a bit more present and a bit punchier, and I, the play was phenomenal so again if you're like right in between you need a beater that's that's soft and warm but still has some presence this would be the one to go for let's check it out y'all And that brings us to the third beater in the collection, y'all, the hard leather beater. Now this is five layers of leather on the brass peg connected on the shaft, nice and firmly, that creates a punchy, more attack-oriented beater, yet still as warm as it gets. In fact, it was my favorite beater of this collection because it gives me everything I would ever want from a felt beater or hope for from a felt beater with none of the things I don't like. Plenty of punch, plenty of warmth, 
plenty of body, plenty of playability, but none of the aggressive attack that you get from hard felt beaters. So it's actually exactly what I would want if I was switching from a hard plastic beater to get a warmer sound. And I could use this in an arena, I could use this in a, a theater, I could use this in a club, and it's gonna have all the punch I need to go from hard rock or, or pop parts to soft country parts without really tripping out. And to be honest, I played softly with it a little bit, and it was pretty articulate in its own right. I actually had some dynamic control over my pedal with this beater, even though it was pretty in your face. So let's check it out, y'all. Okay, y'all, so you got to hear all three of these beaters in action. And I hope you agree with me that this is one seriously versatile and dynamic set of bass drum beaters. Uh, each beater was able to perform across a broad dynamic range, yet still stay true to the dynamic range it was intended for, be it soft, medium, or hard. So if you're looking for a set of bass drum beaters that'll add more warmth to your bass drum sound without sacrificing articulation or playability, or you simply want a set of bass drum beaters that's gonna give you a broader range of tones to allow you to serve a broader range of styles of music, these Dragonfly percussion bass drum beaters just might be the ones for you. So I hope you enjoyed this product review video. Please stick around and watch more videos on YouTube, Kenny Sherritts, or stream in-depth drum tuning lessons at kennysherritts.com.